hello guys this is VJ today we will see how to connect to the JSON API so basically any web uh, REST API service that is uh, returning JSON data like this so this particular one web service and uh, it's like an API and it's returning this JSON data so it's having uh, some post ID, ID name, and then some data is there. So, so let's see your uh, ID name, email and body, and this is a web request. So now we want to use this web API. Just copy this, and then jump into Power BI Desktop and there is a news guys for you it is a very latest version i just downloaded today and uh, i would like to show you how it looks so they have basically added this whole new tab so it's uh, like a ribbon now and uh, okay, let, let me show you the version which is the detail it's a march 2020 so this is the latest version that's uh, what we are working on okay okay get back to the work now we have copied the api and uh, the api is returning the json data so to you uh, now to start with how we will get the data okay so to get data we will uh, use web again the json is a web url so we will focus on web connector so in this uh, particular web URL there is no uh, authentication required so that is configured here on the server the API server so uh, based on the server and the authentication you need to select basic or advanced so right now there is no uh, authentication required here it's a public API so now as you'll say just click on OK. Now, once you hit the OK, you will find a query, a Power Query Editor. And in this, now you have to uh, see your data and make it in appropriate format. OK, so by default, it will come up with the record as a list. So you can see here the list is there and the records are there. Now we need to work on this particular records if i select like there is a uh, there is a one button is there that convert this list into a table okay so to represent this data into power bi dashboard we need to convert that to table first of all So I just click on that now to table how it is possible or how it will convert to the table for that there are two parameters create table from the list so I am not going to change anything here but I will show you okay first one is a delimiter possible delimiters you can use or custom second one is uh, to how to handle an issue or uh, extra columns okay so i would like to show as an error and just click on okay now my data my api data that was list is converted to now the table but now you see here it's showing as a column one and then there are records and you see a small button with two arrows left and right direction arrows now I will click on that arrow button okay and it's showing me the list of fields columns and uh, I will say okay I will select all columns and click on okay so now my actual data is coming the whole this list is becoming now the table okay so 
now I can use this table okay so first of all I just need uh, okay understand this is uh, you can give the proper name if you want let's try with the uh, JSON data so I just gave the name and I will click on close and apply and then I will let's wait refresh automatically okay so it's applying the query changes now once that is done you will find we have another table here with required fields and that will start with column one because it's like a list dot you can consider as your list and then columns so let's simply represent this data into table with your post ID okay it's not selecting mm -hmm. it's taking time then okay, I have this table it's a little slower maybe my machine is slower Now I have to deselect something is wrong. Okay. Then ID. Then name. Email. body Okay guys, so this is done how we have created a simple table in Power BI report with the JSON data. Now the JSON data is uh, basically web API and we are using that web API as a source and for that we have selected the get data option as web. So I hope you like this video. Please write down in the comment if any other uh, data source or uh, any other API you want to call in the Power BI. Let's uh, check it out and uh, if you have any query around or any question or if you stuck anywhere in your project or in your work just uh, message me or ping me or uh, email me I will try to help you guys. Okay, thanks for this. Uh, please share this video with your colleagues, your friend, uh, because we try to uh, put more and more videos uh, for uh, any new Power BI learner, any student, or anyone who is already working and they stuck with some issue. We try to figure it out and uh, help them. Please do like, share, and subscribe. So. If you subscribe the channel that will encourage us to make more videos thank you